looks like we are going Kaisa, Mono Kaisa, uh, with a Demacia some point going up against. Monkey. We're going against the monkey. Gotta keep that monkey on. Gonna drop the jaded butcher. I man, there's so many parts of me that always feel so bad when you have to drop that before it's uh before it gets the uh, plunder proc. I feel you. So I, I, what I was gonna say was is that oh. honestly, I really hate this Kaisa deck without Kaisa, right? <laughs> Bro, like here's my thing. I hate running the Broadwing. Because they get the formidable as their uh, keyword for the uh, what is the uh, the seven cones? The, yes, that is. Oh my god, it feels like such. Hey, it feels so bad actually. Yeah, he did get perfect curve right here, so he will uh, level up on the next turn once he plays the two drop. Cause that well actually hold on that is. One keyword, two keywords, three keywords, four keywords, five keywords. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So on the on this two drop, he will have it. All right, the four drop. There it is. Evolve on deck. Uh, so he does get a six six unit with overwhelm this turn. Doesn't even matter that you got the barrier because I'm still punching you in the throat. Also, uh, R RM did take a quicksand, by the way. Mm. So that's something for ha for Hanzo to be playing around. I mean. He doesn't know, but we uh, know. Yeah. <laughs> we know the vibes. He's like, oh my god, what card did he take from me? Now, I see what he does with this. Uh, he will not be using that. Which, again, makes sense, right? There's no reason for you to waste it right now, just because it's not lethal. Yeah. And it's better to just keep it in hand. That, I'm so 100% behind that type of decision. Going to kill the Broadwing. Plunder a free card. Oh! Uh, he hits. Uh, he does hit a card that does not uh, need it to get the. Uh, it would have got minus two off the cost, but it costs zero. I don't, but I must help the others. See what he does from here. I wonder if we just swing with this team, huh? I think that might be the play here. Wow. He goes for the Padma. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I would want to give up the... Get that up so early. Yeah. Ugh. That's the same thing I was thinking, too. That was... That was a very interesting choice of play right there, because now you just gave up the Teemo. And yeah, you still got the monkeys, but like damage for hey, I'm right here. Don't have enough to quicksand. Honestly, I'm I'm surprised we didn't just use one of those monkeys. And draw our, either our team or the team. Where you at? Exactly. This to your it's it's us. Uh, what? Why not the quicksand? You could have just uh, you could have just dropped one of them back four or. Uh, okay. I guess that's what's more beneficial. I mean, because you do get to draw two. I mean, we are at that point where it is kind of nervous, right? Like, we in the grand finals. There's a lot of a lot of things. This is right there, right before you get a chance to uh, walk across our finish line. So, let's see. Pokey steak. Okay. Draw into a pool shark. Um, Not exactly what they're looking for. Probably looking for another panda. I, we have to take this right of negation. Yeah. You have to take right. Yeah. Yeah, we have to take right. 
But oh wait, we still get blown out by right. Yeah. Uh. We get blown out by opponents, right? Yeah, I mean you just because he this is this is game. Hit. Oh wait, but we can play around they got, it. They wait. got no, they got cataclysm. Yeah. So no, no matter what unit you put on the board, they're gonna cataclysm you. Yeah, and then we and then the, yeah, it's GG. Yeah, it's done. Yeah, that's why uh, RM is trying to carefully consider their options, but it's not looking too good right here at this point. I mean, they do have the um, the quicksand, but I'm not sure how much quicksand will do in this particular situation. Yeah, it's better to not play into the quick uh, play into that, but even with the quicksand here, minusing four, that does not save you. Yeah, we have oh, that. it does! It does! It does! Oh, it puts them to. Cause it, hey, yeah, it removes the DNA prop. I didn't know it did that. Wow, that's actually good information to know. If they have a DNA prop and you click on it, that counts as negating that uh, keyword. So they no longer have that two two bonus. Yeah, yeah. It takes it takes away all keywords, so it takes away the evolved. Yeah, yeah. He just lives at one. Wow. He's living on the dream right now. Again. Go on then. I think right. we're supposed to I think we're supposed to kill this kill the one two and hope to God that we get Tia. Yeah, yeah. That is your biggest bet right here. What? He's playing Nar? Oh, he's playing Nar? Oh, it's Nar Teemo. I guess Nar would benefit a little bit more from this just because he wants to see pinks. Okay. I guess. Yeah, it's just over then. Okay, so one and shot into the monkey. Into another monkey. Bathing out the right, right? Okay, so he won't right. And then another warning shot. I mean, the moment we go for this Gnar, we just cataclysm. Yeah, he can't he can't do that. But wouldn't you just uh play the another warning shot and then pass turn uh deal two? What you mean? So he could uh warning shot, pass turn, he's gonna deal two at the end of it. Wow, he's brave. He is so brave. That takes guts. That takes massive cojones. Oh, we actually drew the monkey, by the way. Yeah, but it doesn't even matter. Yeah, no, it doesn't he matter. He has no way to protect himself from this one. Alright, looks like we're going on to game two. Hanzo taking game one. Now, this doesn't need to be reset or anything. They're just in the grand finals together? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, whoever wins here takes it all. Okay. Still got. Uh, to be honest, I I haven't looked at anyone's decks today. Not gonna lie, I made the spreadsheet and didn't even look at people's decks. I'm a I'm a terrible caster. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you can't uh, you can't put too much on yourself just because of how much you had to navigate. Fifty players, you guys came through, showed out. Hand class for you guys. You guys are awesome for coming through. Hanging out this entire stream and showing so much love and support to the man. So it looks like we're going to be having deep going up against the monkeys once again. 
he did lose with it, so he can just go right back into it with it. Play that. Drop that. To fuck the monkeys. They, okay, so the biggest issue with this monkey deck against D is, um, you know, this card called Withering Whale. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we did see that happen earlier on stream, too. It's amazing, amazing card called Withering Whale. Kind of, kind of blows them out. <laughs> yeah, it does. It really does. It's like, hey, I want to deal six damage to you. How much you only deal to <laughs> Yeah, it's kind of, it's a little D, not going to lie. Ooh, Undergrowth. Going to yeah. toss three, drown two. Yeah, we're just making sure we take as little damage as possible. I mean, I guess, uh, uh, especially against a ping deck, right, where they just want to ping you, mm -hmm. that is definitely huge. Their win con is exactly that. Just pinging you down so they can try to get you to a point where no matter what damage you're able to block, you're still going to take damage from the monkey type of thing. We're going to use I, draw two. Okay, we draw some decent cards, but now we get to develop double C scatter. Ooh, that is not fun at all. Because now... You got to still play your monkeys, and I can just sack units and just go deep back. Yep, you played an R, and guess what? I'm going to drop a free unit right now. Or unless he doesn't have one in hand. <laughs> he don't have one. Ooh, he don't got one. Uh, he, uh, I just take the three, honestly. Yeah, you just take three. Or it's six. It's not lethal. But, uh, I don't know. Really? Deciding to block the Gnar there? Yeah, I would have definitely probably gave it up. And then either Val feast it and sack that unit and get the double scarabs. The double scarabs is going to act as um, the three cost landmark that you used to have. And just constantly just keep milling your deck, but I guess they uh, again you just don't want to get too low against a ping deck because at some point they're just going to get you so low to the point where it doesn't matter how much you're able to block, we just burn you for that much. I guess I can get the reasoning behind that one. Hope you stick. Put some more burn. And draw, and draw, and two, the two. Treasures of the ages. Treasures of the ages. That's not that good in here. And this is what you're doing. Oh, this is, oh my, wait, hold on, hold on. I just realized, this is a terrible matchup. Reason why is because the more you take my cards, the more I'm like, thank God, they're not in my deck anymore. <laughs> I didn't even think about that. Yeah, this is a terrible matchup. This yeah, is an absolutely good. terrible matchup. I almost felt like he almost counterpicked him with this. Ooh, and he got the bow feast for this team all coming up too. Yep. We can't, I mean, I, I, mean, I don't think we, I don't think we cash in the veteran world, but yeah, we definitely bow feast for sure. Who would try Yeah, we Oh no, four. Guess I guess I'll have overwhelm anyway. Monkey. Okay, it's coming through. Three, one. And attack though. Fell a kind of big monkey. What's your favorite avatar? Button. What's your favorite avatar? What avatar in the game? Mm-hmm. Um 
Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> I, I never I, thought about that, it, actually. Yeah, for me, it's definitely uh, the arcade Vanguard or the, um, the the little ghost that smacks himself with the sword. I, I love that little thing. Or the little shark. <laughs> chip is I mean, yeah, it, yeah, it has to be Chip for me then, hundred percent. Chip, Chip, my boy, <laughs> my brother. He did hit deep. I'm gonna go ahead and take the scout in it because he already activated the two calls. Um, the scout is free here. Yep. Z zero mana, five six. And there's the parlay to do another ping to trigger the NAR. Give me the stuff. Stop making Trying to be milling through I'm more not, cards. I think we're just pretty much just looking for our champs now, right? I think they also want to wait for them uh, RM to use a little bit more mana because they want to kill that uh, NAR with this. Yep. Mm. Yeah, killing me. Being able to obliterate all like that is kind of... It's kind of poggers. Well, for Hanzo, anyway. <laughs> for <laughs> RM, <laughs> it, it definitely doesn't feel good for, um, for RM. Yeah. So now you're staring down the board of humongous sea creatures. Does have the alternate win con with the atrocity and also has the um, has the vengeance. So they got a pretty decent amount of checks right here. All right, RM is also deep. Pogger. Imagine. Has to uh, is going to swing wide here. How is Hanzo going to block? Do you give up your elusive unit here? That is the real question. I guess a ping deck, I think that's probably the uh, best call here. Just uh, giving up the elusive unit. Oh no, you can also just vengeance too. That's also, ah, ah. <laughs> and not forget about that option. <laughs> <laughs> I can have an elusive. Yeah, sorry about that. Sorry. No, you wanted to ping me, but um, yeah, we got big boys over here. I'm also thinking. Zero mana, five six. By the way. Yeah, imagine. Hanzo is looking really good right now, and again. RM has to just try to set up Y to block as much as possible. So they gotta just throw away units. But again, uh, Hanzo still has the alternate win con with the um, Vengeance and the Atrocity. That, and they got enough to play both. But I don't think they have a way to stop this. Yeah. That is all she is. Alright. And we got our weekly champion.